Harvest is Canada's largest food rescue organization. And what we do is every day we pick up food, good, perishable, nutrient-dense food, and we redistribute it to over 220 agencies in the city. Today is a fundraiser, but it's more of a community lunch so that people are, are, can become aware of us. Awareness is really, really critical when it comes to building your future as a charity. Uh, most people, uh, you know, they recognize the name Second Harvest, but they don't realize that we are actually a, a um, perishable food rescue organization. Um, and so it's really important people understand that we pick up food that builds really good bodies and really good minds. The Dale Ministries is an organization that exists in Parkdale, which is a West End neighborhood in Toronto. And the Dale uh, has made a conscious choice to place at the core of its community people who often aren't. So people who are marginalized in some way due to uh, being underhoused or substance addiction or mental health challenges. So we host drop-ins throughout the week. Um, many of which include food and the and really the only way that the Dale can do that is by being a member agency of Second Harvest. So that's part of why we're we're here today. Well, we're very concerned about uh, food security especially in Toronto and I think what happens is that what's accessible and what's affordable for people tends to be food that isn't very healthy and so and um, and drop-ins can have a hard time because of course in order to make you know a meal for a lot of people it takes a significant amount of money but we really 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 want to uh, make an effort to provide healthy nutritious meals and sort of teach people about what it takes to cook that way I think it's fantastic I think that what they do is amazing because they're taking food that would have been wasted and they're helping to provide meals to people in the city. It's very local and I love this city and I'm happy to be a part of something that helps. I think it's been about four or five years now I've been working with Second Harvest. I started working with them on their Toronto Taste events, uh, hosting, co-hosting with Bob Bloomer, the Toronto Taste events and doing booth. I'm now an ambassador for the last couple of years. So whenever I'm around and in town, we're doing stuff like this, I'm always here helping out, you know? I just love that we're able to repurpose good food that sits dormant in the food and beverage industry and get it to people who need it. So that we're eliminating waste in the industry, but also giving the people out there what they need, fresh food, you know, so it's pretty awesome. Second Harvest is 30 years old and I've been volunteering with them for about 20 years and about two years ago I became the executive director and uh, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's a charity that I'm very passionate about. I, the people that are involved with Second Harvest, whether they be volunteers or um, employees or board members or the agencies, they, we are all connected. We are all connected to a common goal and that is an amazing feeling. Thank you.